They said 3015 is where the complaint is calling from, but this is this side. Hi. No, did you call? Okay, what's going on? Well, if you just give me a brief synopsis of what's going on. Uh, the first lawyer looks like he should be. He's the manager. Just so you know, everything's being recorded, so. Yeah. Um, we have a tenant that lives there, and they got a guy named Joe that comes over with his family. Well, he's, we've had many problems with him harassing tenants. Okay. And um, I guess... Just like on Halloween, they harassed these girls that just moved in. Uh, made one of the one of, one of the girls give him a hug because she felt like she couldn't get by him and we went to give him a hug. He's constantly out here with a kitchen knife trimming these hedge, hedges. He's not supposed to be doing any work. Does he live here? He doesn't live here. No. He shows this as an address. Yeah, uh, his family's so. not on the lease though. Well, is his family allowing him to live here? Well, they tell him to basically. <laughs> You know, because if his family's allowing him to come in, then they sleep in a v in the van. You where? Know, sleep in the house. Which one? Which van? Sleep in the silver van at night. Okay. And so it's just kind of like we don't know what to do. Or, you know, we were just supposed to just let them just run run amok here and let them harass our tenants and we leave tenants. Right. Well. And there's got to be something. We <coughs> can't keep doing that. He's out. I mean, what you need to do. With a butcher knife and, you know, and then they got friends coming over. Sure. Mm -hmm. They turn around, get back in their car, and leave and won't come over. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Understandable. Here's the problem we've run into the family's allowing him to come here, mm -hmm. which means there's not much we can do. The, in order for you guys to fix the problem, honestly, you're going to have to evict his family out of here. That's that way. What we're trying to do okay. Right now. Um, as far as him trimming, so. trimming trees and all that kind of stuff, that's a, a policy issue with you guys. Yeah, we've told them many times, don't be yeah. coming out here, don't I mean, be doing yard work, stop with the kitchen knife. We can go talk to him and, and see far, what the deal as is. As far as your tenants go, as far as, you know, the, the two girls that they continue to get harassed, if that is what they're... They won't even come out of their house. Sure, and and if it's something that it's because of him, they always have the option, and you can pass this forward to them, if they can go down and get some type of anti-harassment over his <clears> I told them they should have called, she go, I told her, I was like, if they did, he did that, you guys should have called the cops right then and there. Mm -hmm. Right, well, yeah, they and know. they need to call us as well. Cause, exactly, yeah. so make a track record they of what's going on. They just moved in, they're scared, they're mm -hmm. two sisters. You would know. you like us to go talk to him? I would. I mean, Which one is he in? He's in apartment number one. Number one? Okay. okay. I'm the on-site manager, and then my boss, I told my boss Who's about the it. resident of that apartment? Who actually rents it? Um, the, I can't remember her name, but it's an old grandma. And she, okay. Is he still here? Yeah. Okay. okay. All right. Talk to him. Okay. I mean, uh, you guys need to put okay. okay. Thank you, sir. Number uno? He's what? Joe, right? Yeah. Joseph Brasier. Hi. Hi. Hey, how's it going? Good. Good. Are you Joe? No. Is there a Joe here? No, Liz is right in there. This one? Yeah. Oh. Number two? Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Sorry about the end. All right.
Yeah, this one's probably it. Probably. Hi there. Is hey. Joe here? Joe. Joe. Joe first here. Hi. Joseph. And there we go. Hi, Joe. How are you? Can you do me a favor and have a seat on the curb? Well, you're not in trouble. I just want to chat for a sec, okay? Just so you know everything you say is being uh, recorded, okay? Perfect. So, here's the deal, okay? We're getting complaints from a lot of the tenants here saying that you're causing problems. Uh, notably, we're getting complaints from the managers saying you're out here cutting trees, you shouldn't be doing any shrubbery work, you're out here with kitchen knives trimming, and then you're harassing uh, some of the female tenants here. So, here's the deal, okay? Um, you need to watch your behavior when you're when you're here. If you're an invited guest here, to I guess this is your family's apartment. You don't live here, correct? I think I do. You do? You think you do? Yeah. Okay. Well, if you live here, then you need to be respectful with everybody else that's here. Okay. Me, yep. Go ahead. I am. Okay. Yeah. I, I'm not here, so I don't know. I'm just getting the complaints, and so they asked me to come talk to you. So just be aware of what you're doing and who you're doing it to and know that the shrubbery work isn't your responsibility. Okay? So also be aware that if you're violating uh, property rules that you guys can be evicted. So if you're doing something that is violation, then they can evict your family out of here, which means you've got to go as well. Okay? Are we clear? Good to go? Thank you for your help, dude. What did you say about the violating the rules? Yeah. If you violate the rules, they can evict you. Okay, but no. Is, it, is that the law? That's the landlord tenant law, yeah. Yeah, I, I didn't know nobody. Okay. Right. Well, I'm just letting you know that that's a possibility for them, okay? You tell them jealousy out of here. Man. You betcha. I'll let them know. Okay. Right on. Any questions? Good night, dude.